Assalamu alaikum, great for this is teacher Hadil al zohbi from Taqarub International Schools and today inshallah we are going to start with our reading lesson today which is we always do our homework. Always means da'iman, every day, okay? In other words, yani. So homework, what is a homework? Yes, excellent, wajib or wajibat, okay? Let's start with our dialogue. <coughs> I'm gonna read the dialogue, explain each picture, and then um, we are going to discuss it together. Karim, my name is Karim. This is my friend Ali, he is a new pupil. So this is a new word, okay? We are gonna cover it when we go to explain the vocabulary. Now, Ali and Karim are new friends, okay? So they are meeting each other every day where? At school. My name is Samira. This is our classroom. Now, where are you? Or where do you take lessons? Where do you do your homework? Where do you play? Where do you meet your friends and teachers? Yes, in the classroom. Classroom in Arabic, Al-Saf, okay? Miss Nadia is our teacher. This is Layla, she is a new pupil. Hello, come with us, I can show you around the school. So, they are going to show the new pupil. Pupil means student, they are the same. We call them synonyms. What do we mean by synonyms? Muradifat, which means a word has, or two words have, the same meaning but a different spelling or pronunciation. Yani in Arabic, in Muradifat al Kalimat, Lihumme, Kilimatin, Ilhum Nafsil Mana Basesh, Bihtilfu Bil Lafid, Ubil Kitabe. Okay, but they share the same meaning. Picture number two. What can you see in picture number two? Yes, excellent. Students and books. Samira, this is the library. We always read books here. We never talk in the library. So they don't talk in the library. Why is that? Because they study, read books in the library. Picture number three. This is the lab. We always have science here. Science is one of your subjects. Can you guess which subject is Science, now let me give you a hint. You have animals, um, plants in this subject, stars, planets, yes, excellent. Science means علوم, okay? Lab is where you do your experiments. يعني المكان اللي بتعملوا فيه تجارب العلوم. Where do we have PE lessons? We have PE lessons in the hall. We always run and exercise. Now, you have the word run and exercise. So, what do you conclude from this word run and exercise? Or what do you get to make it easier? Yes, sport, riyada. So this is the place where we do exercise or sport. Picture number four, do you do, uh, what do you do after school? We always do our homework. What do we mean by homework? We said it at the beginning of our uh, class. Yes, wajib. At the weekend, we go to the park. We ride our bikes in the park. Do you want to come to park with us? Ali says, yes, I do, thank you. So, <coughs> Since we have finished our dialogue, we are going to introduce the vocabulary, okay? The first one is pupil. Pupil means in Arabic, a talib. Now, as you know, we have parts of speech for each word, okay? In Arabic, a talib. Yani, ism wala fa'il? Yes, ism. So, in English, it is a noun. So, the part of speech of pupil, a noun, and the meaning is student. 
library is also a noun, which is the place where you can read and borrow books. What do we mean by the word borrow? Yes. Yes, yes, Ta'id. Yes. The last one is PE, and PE is an abbreviation. What is the abbreviation? Abbreviation, yani ikhtisar. Abbreviation for physical education. Physical education. And notice the pronoun, the pronunciation. These two letters, we pronounce them as fa. F, F, so F. We write them as P and H, but they are pronounced as F, F. So it becomes physical, physical, okay? So we write and we pronounce. We have a shapes for the letters and a sounds. The sound is F. And this is how we write the sound. This is how we write the shape of the letter. Okay? We have some advanced transcription or pronunciation for this word education. We don't pronounce it as education, it becomes education. Okay? Okay? And this was the last word for today. Thank you for listening.